Morning, morning. Beautiful day out. Check it out behind me. Clear, sunny, beautiful. We are going for a 10K this morning. And uh, that's the goal. Get your workout in today, of course. Whatever it is you're into, man, it's the same words. Knock it out, get it done, accomplish it. Let's have some fun with this workout. Enjoy the rest of your day. Let's do this. Hey, welcome back to the channel. Much love to you. My name is Juice. Welcome back. If you are a returning back subscriber, thank you very much for being here. Thank you for returning back. If you are new here, support this channel by subscribing and press the bell notification. Comment, like, and share, of course, and um, do those things and we're all set. So if you hear some noise in, in the background, this is my washing machine. I'm washing clothes, obviously, so excuse the audio or the noise in the background. It's a machine. And this is going to be a post-workout meal, one of my favorite go-to meals that I eat or drink after a workout. Um, after a, a 10K run or any, work, any type of workouts, this is one of my favorite workout or go-to meals. I've been eating this for five plus years now. Super delicious, easy to make, um, just high in protein, high in calories, good stuff, really good stuff. So let me stop talking and show you the ingredients of one of my favorite meals. But before I do that, I already made the drink. This is a smoothie, a, I'll show you what I, you know, have as, as far as the ingredients, but this is, I, it, was, it was a six cup smoothie. I drink the rest of it, but this is just the remaining of the six cup smoothie. So excuse me um, not showing you the entire um, size of the actual smoothie. But anyway, let's um, go to the ingredients and get this video started. All right, so here we are. So I'm gonna show you each of the following ingredients to make this um, smoothie. Once again, it's easy to make. And just to let you know, this is not sponsored by any brands. No companies pay me to make this video or talk about the following items I'm going to show you, but just um, my own little video that I want to show you what I usually drink after a workout or you know as a post-workout meal. So without further ado, let's show you the first ingredient or um, item that I use to make my smoothie. So here we go. This is one of my favorite powder uh, peanut butter um, things. <laughs> I'm not sure what you call these exactly, but it's a powdery substance as you can see. It's peanut butter. You can find this at Walmart, um, of course Publix. I'm not sure about Whole Foods, but any popular supermarket will probably carry, if, if not this brand, something like this. Once again, it's a powdery substance. Really tasty stuff. There's the inside of it. And it's just a powdered uh, peanut butter uh, mix. I'm not sure you can call it a mix. I'm not sure what you call it. But that's what I use to put inside my smoothie. Good stuff. It's not that crazy in calories, not that high. Three servings of this inside my smoothie. So good stuff, really, really tasty. And I highly recommend it if you're into peanut butter smoothies. Once again, please excuse the noise. Please excuse the noise, it's the machine running. So there it is, that's one. Next is some bananas. Self-explanatory, nothing new here. You can find this anywhere, <laughs> literally where so I don't explain exactly what you see here. But I usually use um, two bananas inside my smoothie, sometimes three. But um, today I only had two, um, so that's what we're doing right now. So only two bananas so far inside the smoothie. It's out of the way. Next is going to be something I've spoke about before and multiple videos on my channel. So this is one of my favorite um, milk alternatives for my smoothies. Even some of my cereals too, my cereals. <laughs> Hope that makes sense. But here it is. This is one of my favorite milk alternatives. This is non-dairy, AKA vegan. Really, really um, good stuff. Um, once again, it's soy milk. Look at the amount, I mean, like the grams of protein you get per servings. 20 grams of protein. That's crazy inside of a freaking soy milk, right? Um, I think it's like, yeah, seven servings, but I usually pour maybe two cups in here. I'm, so, I'm sorry, two servings in here. But the, um, it's pretty high in calories, look at that. 180, that's awesome. Very low in sodium, I love that. Just good stuff. This is like, I just love the fact that it's just high in calories and two, 20 grams of protein, bro, this is dope. Sometime I use this um, milk alternative. Let me, let me let me show you what I have. Let me go inside my fridge real quick. Sometimes I use this. This is really good too, oat milk. This is tasty. If you're not into soy milk, right? I recommend this for your smoothies. Oat milk is the bomb. Oh my God, <laughs> I think you'll love it. If not this brand, there's other types of brand. There's Oatly. Oatly is, is, is another um, brand that makes oat milk. Oat milk. So yeah, this is good stuff right here. Sometimes I put this inside my smoothie as well, but 
not this not 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 this morning we're using the soy milk 20 grams right there so good stuff let me put this back in the fridge keep it nice and cool all right moving on so we got the peanut butter and some soy milk next some old-fashioned oat milk so that's inside the smoothie as well once again um i put some time maybe um either half a cup or a whole cup of oat inside my um, smoothie and I like it it's just good stuff it's very there's no sodium I love the fact there's no like it's not it's like zero percent sodium which is beautiful nothing too crazy here really clean clean foods good stuff sometimes I use this type of um, oat milk inside my smoothie let me open inside the cupboard let me show what I'm talking about this is it's pretty expensive but um it's good if I can find it Jesus Christ. Did my wife eat it all? Did she eat all my... Where is it? <laughs> I can't find it. Oh no. I'm sorry for this uh, unprofessional part of the video. I can't find... Where she put my damn oatmeal, man? Okay, so I can't find it. Anywho, so usually I, I use um, still cut oats in my oatmeal. I had some here. I can't, I can't find it. I think my wife ate it all. I think she ate the whole thing, bro. I mean, that's, that's good. Maybe she likes it. Cool, but hey. All right, I gotta get some more still cut oatmeal. Anywho, so I use I sometimes use that in, into my oatmeal. This the still cut oatmeal, on um, the oats, but uh, we don't have any right now, so we've been using this. Right. Moving on. All right. Last but not least, um, this is from a cool company called I hope I pronounce it right. Vegetox. Hope I pronounced that right. But of course, it's some super greens. Um, powder substance as you can see here let me open it up for you hope you can see the inside of that there it is it's pretty dark in there <laughs> but yeah um, it's just some good green up inside the smoothie let me show you the ingredients in here wheatgrass barley grass um, chlor chlorella hope I pronounced that right chlorella some spirulina just good stuff look at all this right some superfoods some clean clean stuff so i'm not sure if you're, if, if you're into this into eat, like eating super greens or super types of food but i will leave a link down below of this product once again i'm not sponsored at all from anyone to talk about any of the following products but i do have the link to this you can find this on on, on amazon this goes great in a smoothie just some just some green some clean stuff keep it nice and healthy got all your 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 minerals and your vitamins Stuff that you need every day so yeah some b12 just good stuff up in this side side this product but yeah this is the following um item that i use inside my smoothie which is this bad boy right here this is freaking tasty once again this is my go to meal this might be the thumbnail right here this might be you know what let me, let me, let me go just make the thumbnail right now <laughs> this is gonna be the thumbnail there you go something like this boom so yeah, that's 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 a smoothie. Once again, it was, it was a six cup smoothie, and um, I had the rest of it. But I just thought, let me just make a video about this. Maybe someone wants to know what I, what what like, do I eat? You know, um, after a nice workout. But here it is, good stuff. Let me just have to let me just take a little sip. Mm. Oh my god, so good. Oh my god, so good. Mm. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, let me turn this around. And there you have it. So that's 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 the setup right there. Once again, my go-to post-workout meal. So delicious. I actually have a, a recipe um, book where you can find this, um, this, this recipe in. I'll leave a link down below as well. If you're into eating plant-based foods, which I very much re re recommend, um, high in protein, high in calories. It's a really cool ebook. There's a lot of recipes besides smoothies in there. There's rice bowls, really clean stuff. I love that. I love eating clean as much as possible. And that's why I chose a plant-based diet. But we won't make this video about that. But this is, again, the go-to post-workout post meal. And I love it very much. Delicious. So let me finish this cup of smoothie and continue my day. And much love to you. Thanks for watching. I'll be back with more videos, of course. You be safe out there. Once again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you got some value from this. And I'll be back with more videos. Peace out. Thanks for watching once again.